look at that. JJ's Pawn Shop. Yeah. As you may know, y'all, over there across the street from the movies, that's JJ's Pawn Shop. The old Burger King building used to be right there. Yeah, but now they already set up a new place called JJ's Pawn Shop. Because in that place, they're selling firearms and jewelries. Now, there used to be a steakhouse right there. But, however, they closed that place down because the meat wasn't too good. Yeah, I'm just showing you guys about the places that we're having right now. Because as you can see, there's JJ's Pawn Shop. Next to it is Hot Hot Pot. And there's the Sourdough Gas Station. We used to have the uh, Texaco Gas Station there, but they got rid of it. But Wendy's is still there, which is behind me, as you can see on my rear view mirror. And the movies are still there too, which I'm at right now. Over there, there's the, uh, the apartments, over there. McDonald's is still there, Subway's still there, but they added Verizon. And also there's that 24-hour restaurant there. I mean, we went there twice, but I only went in there once. The second time we went there, well, it was after my graduation. And that was three years ago. But too bad I didn't go inside of it after I had to throw a temper tantrum. My graduation party. Yeah, it is light snow outside today maybe March, but the temperature is still going down to below zero at night. And daylight savings in two days, so all the clocks will be set one hour forward. Spring break happening next week, but Lance and I are still have to deal with, do, deal with, with work. I don't like JJ's Pawn Shop. I don't like it with what they're selling. Firearm weapons? Why would they want to sell firearms? You know I don't like firearms. But who cares? They already made that place a year ago. In fact, we need more places in Fairbanks. I mean, I've been living in Fairbanks, Alaska all my lifetime. I mean, because Fairbanks, Alaska used to be good two decades ago. But that was when I was little. But then a decade ago, Fairbanks, Alaska turned into a ghost town. Which means not much places to go. Or not much places to go. Fairbanks, Alaska is losing its good places. Like Kmart, that other, that other McDonald's and College Road next to Bentley Mall. We lost Chili's. Jeez, what is going on with these restaurants? Well, now it seems like that Fairbanks, Alaska is turning out to be a ghost town. Nowhere else to go. And Bentley Mall is turning out to be a ghost town too. Because they're shutting, they already shut down three stores in there. Because now there are three vacant stores in there. I mean, there has been a lot of vacant areas in Fairbanks. But however, nobody can afford that much money. I mean, that old Kmart building has been vacant for years. Because that place was closed, closed down since 2004. And nobody can afford 
a lot of money in that for that old Kmart building. <sighs> Anchorage has more places than Fairbanks. Well, that's all I have to say to y'all, guys. I'm just showing you around what Fairbanks used to be in the past. Two decades ago, 